Alright guys, welcome to my newest Let's Play of Dragon Age Origins. Um, if you haven't seen my last one, I suggest you go and watch that one. Um, so I, I feel a little compelled to make this because since I reformatted my computer, as you can see I no longer have a load game. I don't have any other games anymore. And with uh, Dragon Age Awakening coming out within a month or so, I kind of need to uh, get a character up to that point because I don't want to make a new character on that and you know all that good stuff. So uh, we'll be making a new character and everything. As for uh, content, we obviously have uh, Blood Dragon armor and Stone Prisoner, and I will have Return to Ostgar by the time uh, by the time we get to that point. Um, see what else is there. If anything, I'll pro yeah, I'll play on normal because uh, last time I posted this on like Game FAQs, some guy was like, "Oh boy, I instantly turned it off because you played on easy mode." It's like, uh, yeah, sorry that uh, I wanted to show him this before. As you can see, this setting is best suited to players who are new to role-playing games or expect to play combat in real time rather than pausing often to play to plan tactics. At this setting, party members are immune to friendly fire and will heal easily while enemies inflict less damage than normal. Uh, it's basically the first part. I I wouldn't say new to role playing games as I do I have played, you know, Diablo 2 and all that good stuff, but I did I did expect to play combat in real time. Normal mode. This is the recommended setting for players familiar with role playing games providing a good balance of challenge and survivability. It requires moderate use of tactical pausing to plan actions. I do pause quite a bit, depending on you know certain things, but meh. But yeah, that guy was felt the need to bitch about that, so I felt the need to bitch back and explain my reasoning for it. But we'll play on normal this time. Um, there are a couple, how can I say it, uh, glitches, exploits, whatever. Uh, one in particular I'll probably use, eh, so I don't want people bitching at me if I use that too. Because while I do plan on trying to do all side questing and everything, I'm not real sure if I want to do every single possible fucking quest. Because again, I'm mainly doing this because of Dragon Age Awakening come out, and I don't want to make a new character on that. I'd rather just uh, import a character over. Um, but we'll see how that works out. Um, this playthrough will be of the dwarf, though, if you're wondering. And I'm not sure if I want to do a commoner or um, or noble yet, so I'll figure that out eventually. And yes, he since he's a dwarf, he is still going to be the uh, the angry son of a bitch that I want him to be. Um, I'm pretty sure that if I, I'm pretty sure with a character since he'll be a warrior, I think, I'm pretty sure that strength will make it so that using. Uh, what is it? Persuasion. You don't persuade people, I think you just intimidate, but I'll have to look into that again. Um, if it is intimidation, then that will be fun. I will use intimidation as much as I can to get further into the game. So what else is there? I did. I think, I'm not sure if I put this in a video, but since he has a dwarf, it means that dwarves can't do magic, so he will hate all things magic. If, a, if there's a magical solution to something, he will not do it. It's just how I'm going with this character. Um, let's see what else is there. Huh. Oh, a few things about the last Let's Play. Because I, I always got comments about this. Uh, certain things that you can find in the game. Or, like with Shale, you can put crystals. and or, I think they're yeah, flawed, flawless, all that good stuff. I actually know about that now. Uh, during the first LP, I did not. So I don't want... Uh, so I don't want people, you know, constantly commenting about how I should do this or that. Because remember, it is my Let's Play. I'm playing it how I choose to. And I'd rather explain all this now in the intro because I remember Togoth's video where he just went off on every or on a few people who uh, kept telling him to do his character this way or that way. And like he says, like it was his character. He's playing it how he wants to. Same here. I'm playing this character how I want to and everything. And, uh... Well, I mean, I'm only making the intro right now, anyway, so...
you know, all's, all's fair for now. If you want to bitch and moan about one particular thing, go for it on this video. Um, I'm not sure if I'll play any further today. Not feeling the best. Um, and again, since Awakening is coming out, I'm not sure if I'll get it on the exact day it comes out. I'm not too sure about it. Um, that is a good month away or so still. I think, anyway, I'll have to look into it again. Uh, but the problem is that the last LP took about a month to, fit, to do the whole uploading, starting from the day I started to the day it finished. And if you know, with this one, since I have a higher difficulty and I'm doing more stuff in it, it's probably going to take longer, which is kind of annoying. So I'll probably try to play it more often and upload faster. But again, we'll have to see how things turn out. Um, but yeah, it's good to be back to doing Let's Plays. I tried to do other ones. I tried to do uh, Bioshock 1 and 2, you know, a few other games I tried to do, it didn't work out too well. I'll get back to those later though. Um, but again, I just got this game installed and I just got uh, download content that you saw. Uh, those two, I just got those done uh, like 10, 20 minutes ago. And I'm hoping this intro is not too long, so I'm just going to stop it here and I guess I'll see you guys when we start the LP. So, see you soon.